Hi there. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Wolfram Mathematica 11's help on commands and your formulas. So first thing, we open Mathematica and then we create new document. Okay, once we create the document, let's come up with some formula. Okay, so I have this keyword round and I'm going to use it to round a number okay so let's round 21.8 and it will output as 22 now you have suggestion bar right here that will show you prime factorization divisors binary form and number of primes okay so you get various type of suggestion and you see how to use those action depending on what you are intending to use like divisors if you have some of the operation required then you can use that or simply find out how many primes are there under 22 you can do that too okay now the next thing is what if you want some help on this round okay so you simply select that and then you expand this and you'll get idea of what this is it shows you gives the integer closest to x and if you show that with two values such as x and a it rounds the nearest multiples of a okay so it shows you basically usage of this keyword but what if you want to know more about it so you simply select that and then press F1 okay so by doing that you get a documentation okay it shows you the current suggestion that you have highlighted also you see how to use this round with one example 2.4 in our case we use another then it also shows you the plot that used for rounded numbers similarly you also see the closest up to 10th possible multiple of 10th okay so 226 nearest multiple of 10 which is 230 okay then there are some other options such as scope generalization application where it can be used like Fibonacci and then you have properties and relations okay and finally possible issues with this okay so the round does not automatically resolve some of the mathematical expressions so that also is listed here Okay, so this is basically your documentation window. Here you can go for some other command such as pi and you get information about pi as well. Okay, you can search through keywords. You can learn more about any other formula as well. And you can go to the home page. And here you get this specific help on code language data visualization and other options okay so this is full of help file offering help on various topics okay you can close this by closing the button at the top right and you come back to your notebook so this was a short video on how to access localize help within notebook and also how to access documentation browser from your notebook.